Beer Week here on Daybreak. We don't need a reason. But uh, craft beer certainly has become very important, very unique here in Colorado. Yeah, but what defines a real beer drinker? Well, Heather Mills is here to explain there's no definition needed because it's for everybody. It sure is, and there are plenty of beer drinking clubs and groups here in Colorado, but one in particular is making a splash. It's part of an international organization specifically for women. Since the beginning of beer, women have been involved, but at some point it changed from making it to selling it. Now the message is changing again, and groups like Barley's Angels are shining a light on a new revolution. We don't just drink beer in pink bottles or fruity beers. Focuses on a group of people that maybe hasn't been included in craft beer for a long time other than you know, on a billboard in their bikini or something like that. <laughs> Deborah Cameron started this chapter two years ago, and now there are more than a thousand women across the front range who take part. I started this group with like zero knowledge of craft beer. She says she just wanted to share her love of suds and learn more about the process. The more I've learned, the more fun I have had learning and the more I realize how much there is to know. That's why she keeps each event small, about 30 people, that way the group can really get to know the brewers and owners and feel comfortable asking questions. So there's other things that make an apricot taste like an apricot. Testing out a special bottle release at former Future Brewing Company in Denver is just another one of the perks. Pop a top again. If you like sangria, you would probably like this. Mm, that's delicious. A more intimate setting to allow these beer drinkers to expand their knowledge and let their taste buds soar. I've learned to appreciate beer that I would not normally order. And while the group is open to experts and newbies of all different ages and backgrounds. There's so much camaraderie and learning from each other. Uh -huh. And I made all kinds of friends. It's still uniquely female. Sure, what are you having? Oh, I want to try yours yeah, too. Yeah. And ultimately, all about one thing. Enjoy it. That's what beer's all about. Yay, salud. Cheers. Cheers. I enjoy doing this story. I will do them anytime. Now, Barley's Angels is actually pairing with former future, and they're going to do some beginner and intermediate beer classes coming up next month. So we put both those links on our website. That way you can kind of find out all the beer happenings around town. But uh, pretty fun, pretty neat group. Pairing. Yeah. They, they do beer pairings. They do. People do, do match mm -hmm. foods with beers mm -hmm. all the time. They now told me them. weird things, too, like ice cream and things you wouldn't think of. Um, but it works, apparently. Everything works now with beer. All right, maybe you'll want to check it out. Check out the website for all the info. Yeah. Thanks, Heather. Mm -hmm. Okay, also this morning.